Hey guys, welcome back to another week of What's for Dinner. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. Our channel is all about the food. We do taste tests, grocery hauls, recipes, and what's for dinner. And I am kicking off another week of What's for Dinner with a new favorite, which are these um, Ego Thick and Fluffy French Toast. Now I showed these on another What's for Dinner. Let me show you the box again, here you go. So here's the box and it recommends that you make them or that you cook these in a toaster or in the oven, but I decided to make them in a skillet like I would with the traditional French toast, which means I added some butter in the skillet and then I just kind of pan fried them. And mine is a little bit glossy because I have some melted butter on there. And um, we have some cheesy eggs. By the way, Howard made our dinner for today. So we have some cheesy eggs, scrambled eggs. And this is the cheese that he used for the eggs. And then we are also having some turkey bacon, which, not turkey bacon, sorry, turkey sausage. And this is what it is, Jimmy Dean's right there. And we are also having some maple syrup. I've mentioned before, I'm not a big table syrup person. So we're just having some maple syrup that Howard heated up in the microwave for a little bit. And then we are just using Costco brand maple syrup. It was in the fridge, of course, because we opened it. And then he just warmed it up a little bit in the microwave. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight. And we'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, so let me show you what we are having for dinner tonight. Howard made some jerk pork, and normally he grills it, but the weather was um, a little unpredictable today. We weren't sure if it was gonna rain, so he made it in the oven, and this is um, pork shoulder in chunks, and we are serving it over some jasmine rice. And then I made some fried cabbage with bacon, so here that is. And for dessert, we are trying the Blueberry Bliss. Here it is. It is the flavor of the month from Nothing Bunt Cakes. You know how much we love this, but I just got one for us to split. Just trying to eat a little bit better and do a little bit better. But um, so this is what's for dinner tonight. Jerk pork over jasmine rice with fried cabbage and Blueberry Bliss cake for dessert. See you guys next time. Hey guys, Howard and I are trying a new restaurant today. It is called Sauce, and it is Italian fare. And apparently they have them in California, Arizona, and Texas only. So we got a special where we get a large salad to split. You get to pick your salad, and then you get a little bit of bread with it. We're just waiting on our entrees. Um, the special also comes with two glasses of wine or any other beverage. So we got fountain drinks. Howard got a like an agave cream soda, and I just got a I can't remember Sierra Mist or something. Anyway, um, our entree is coming. We actually got a pizza, so I'll show you that as soon as it gets here. So our pizza just came out of the pizza oven and we ordered a sausage and caramelized onion pizza. I think this is 12 inches. So we got the original crust, which is a thin crust. And so here it is. We can't wait to dig in. And we'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, we are having something quick and easy tonight, Chicken Express. I had to make a stop after work and um, did not feel like cooking when I got home. So Chicken Express is a local restaurant around, chicken restaurant around here. And um, the chicken is looking a little sad. Hopefully it tastes better than it looks. Normally it's really good, but I just got four thighs, which came with one roll and I added a couple of extra rolls and then four sides. I got some jalapeno poppers. They put three poppers in this big little box big little box, that doesn't make sense, in this big box. And then I also got a side of mashed potatoes. We have some corn in the fridge we need to eat, so we're gonna add that to our meal. And then I got Howard an apple pie and me a cherry pie. And these are fried pies, they are so good. So anyway, this is what's for dinner tonight and we'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, so for dinner tonight, I made one of my favorite meals, which is chicken in the crock pot. 
Today, I just threw some chicken legs in the crock pot. Um, all I did was season them up, no water at all, and um, just cooked them in the crock pot on low for about five hours. Now, the only thing about making chicken in the crock pot is that it doesn't get brown um, like it would if you cooked it in the oven. So I really should have added some paprika or something like that to give it some color, but I didn't. Um, so here it is in the crock pot, crock pot. And here it is on the plate. And we are also trying out for the very first time some Nor Selects. Let me show you. It is the four cheese risotto. We've never tried this before, but it's something I had in my pantry that I needed to use. And it's actually pretty good. It's not bad. You make it with milk. I was planning on making some green beans to go with the meal and I looked in my freezer and I did not have any um, green beans in my freezer at all. So I decided to use, or not use, um, to make this salad from Taylor Farms. It is a Caesar chopped kit. Here it is, oh, let me show you. So it has Parmesan cheese in there, um, cheese and garlic crouton crumbles, and here it is in the bowl. So this is what's for dinner tonight, and we'll see you guys next time.